okay so very fresh good morning to all okay in that last lecture we have covered see these figures again this okay this figure okay uh, two three figure we have tried to cover in that last lecture regarding to that uh, 2d drawings okay so again we will take some difficult figure and we'll try to draw such figure in that okay okay so can i start yes yes sir okay just yes, see here in that last lecture we have covered this figure then this figure then i think this figure is also covered okay then okay so now in that today's lecture okay this figure is also we have to yeah right yeah right this figure yes sir okay so okay so in this today's lecture again we will make practice for more figures so that you will become familiar to that 2d drawing okay then see here always figure we have to take here okay so can i take this figure yes okay so yeah. again just we have to follow the similar similar process okay suppose we can see the four number example okay then tell me how to draw this figure okay what is the procedure to draw this figure okay first of all we have to analyze the given figure its geometry all the dimension okay then we have to understood about which commands are required to draw such type of the figure okay and then we have to start to draw such type of the figure okay with the help of the autocad or in that autocad okay just here which parameter they have given which parameter they have given or which uh, what is the geometry of this figure simple see here here two circles are there okay see this is the circle number 1 again see we can call it is the circle number 2 okay again here is the one circle again here is the second circle okay one dash two dash means in this figure it consists of four circles then then which part is remaining c this part how to draw this part yes anybody tell me how to draw this part yes how to draw this part yes please by using fillet by using fillet okay then radius fillet ki sir yes sir yes radius which radius means which which command here we have to require tan tan radius yes which command we have to require here tan yes. tan radius tan tan radius okay such type of the example we have taken na in that last lecture same process we have to follow hmm see the given figure here okay see here what is the diameter of the circle first upon tell me what is the diameter of the circle yes what is the diameter of the circle see here they have gone yes may right 2 into 0.58 means what why it is 2 is written because two circle okay the diameter of the circle and the diameter of the circle it will be the Point fifty-eight. Okay, and again, see carefully. Okay, here, okay, here they have given dimension in such way that from this point, ah, uh, from this point, this radius they have given. See this radius. What is this radius? Yes. What is this radius? Yes. May I have the ball? Hello. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. Tell sir. me. What is this radius? 
From this point, again in similar manner, from this point, the radius of this curve is also r point a. Okay. Means what? What is the meaning of this? Means from this center point, again we have to draw one circle here. Simple. Again we have to draw one circle here of radius point a. Okay, and then, then we have to draw this line. What is indicate this line? This line is indicate that it is the tangent line, right? It is the tangent line to this circle and this circle. Okay, again, this line is tangent to the this circle and this circle. Simple figure is complete. Only that much thing we have to understand. Okay, means here for star pound, we have to see here, see the given dimension of that figure. Okay, simple. Suppose for star pound, I have drawn one random horizontal line. Okay, or we can say we have to draw one horizontal line of a distance. What is this distance they have given? Yes, what is this distance? Yes, two point thirty is here. First of all, we have to draw one horizontal line of 2.30 and then, then from this line, we have to draw one vertical line up to this point. Means what is this distance? This distance, it will be the 2.20. Okay. Then we will get this center point and from this center point, we have to draw this circle. What is the die of this circle they have given? That is the yes, one point one twenty. Okay. Again, from this center point, we have to draw this circle. Simple. Okay. Its diameter is also given. Okay. Two. Two. Then from this point, ah, huh? okay. Then from this point, from this point, by considering this as a center point, we have to draw this circle of R. 0.80 again from the center point. Okay, we have to draw this circle of R80 and then we have to join with the help of the tangent line. See, this is the tangent line. Then tell me how to draw the tangent line. What is the procedure for tangent line? Yes. What is the procedure for tangent line? How to draw the tangent line? Line command. Okay. Line. Press shift. Shift. Right click. Okay. Right click. Then select tangent. Okay. Put tangent. Okay. In this way, we have to draw this. We have to draw this figure with the help of that. So we'll start. Okay. First up on, we have to draw horizontal line of 2.30 and then draw the vertical line of 2.12. So immediately I will start. Just you have to remember the dimension. Okay. Then go to the line command, draw one horizontal line, make our the more on. Okay. What is the dim dimension of that horizontal line? Two point? Yes. 30, 2.30. 2.30. Enter escape. Zoom. Okay, zoom it. Okay, then next again from the midpoint of this line, we have to draw one vertical line of what distance? Sir? Yes, 2.12. Two, 2 2 okay, good. Enter SK. Okay, then what is the next step? Then here, see, by considering this as the center point here, we have to draw the two circle, that big circle. Okay, the diameter of that circle, they have given C. The diameter of this yeah. circle. Diameter of that two circle is the two and one point, 125. Okay. Take the, make a click on the circle. 
select the central diameter circle okay make the click here and draw the first of all draw the small circle that is the 5 1.125 okay then draw the second circle of dia 2 okay it is clear yes 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 sir yes sir then in this side okay at the end of this line horizontal line again we have to draw the circle okay in this side one circle and again in this side another circle just see the given figure and dimension of that circle what is the radius of this circle sorry diameter of this circle is the point 58 okay point 58 then go to the circle make a click select the diameter circle here make a click and point 58 now yes Has sir okay interesting again similar circle we have to require at this end so how to draw it can i copy it yes copy yes make a click on the copy select this circle Press the enter, select the center point, and make click on this center point. Okay. Yes. Understood. Yes, sir. Okay. Then see the given figure. Okay. Then what is the next step? Again, we have to draw this circle by considering this as the center point, and from from that center point, they have given the radius of this circle that is the yes point 80 again in this side this is the 0 point 80 and we have to draw this circle okay may I write okay similar circle okay take the whether it is the diameter or radius 0 0.80 yes radius. Is radius just one yes okay, radius make a click on the circle select the radius and this point that is the 0 0.80 radius enter escape okay so here similar circle is required in this side so again we have to make the copy make the copy select this enter select center point and select the center point okay then see the given figure which part is remaining see here okay center. only only this line we have to draw and this line is nothing but it is a tangent to this circle and this circle again this line is tangent to the this circle and this circle again this line is tangent to the this circle and this circle okay just we have to use the tangent line okay we are knowing that how to draw the tangent line simple okay go to the line shift uh, sorry press the shift make the right click click on the tangent and see this is the point and this is the point okay shift the right click tangent again select this line okay line shift the right click tangent and this side also yep. shift click tangent Okay, so then we have to trim the unwanted portion just pressing the TR, double enter, trim it and trim it. This portion is not required. Okay. Yes. It is complete. Yes, please. Okay, it is as per the given figure. Okay, 
so check the given figure Let's see this is the given figure and we have drawn this similar figure in that attribute also okay it is correct yes please yes sir yes, okay sir. then what is the next procedure we have to do the dimension okay make the click here in annotation tab okay take the suppose diameter select this okay then again take the diameter okay take the diameter here then again take the radius okay so this is the 80 radius just point 80 then okay take the linear and let's show this dimension and again take the linear and show this dimension okay in this way we have to show the dimensions okay then okay no problem all dimensional is completed now check the given figure sorry this figure it is clear yes yes sir so any doubt any problem no sir okay so can i take the next figure okay so we will take the next figure Let's see okay so this figure okay this figure okay we will take next example as this figure so just you have to now you have to tell me how to draw this again it is very simple who will tell me how to draw this figure in that autocad yes please yes who will tell me this plate we have to draw in that regard then how to draw this plate yes please please tell me the procedure first of all try to understood the dimension geometry then which commands are required and then we will proceed to draw this figure with the help of that okay so anyone can me tell me how to draw this figure yes please first draw the whole rectangle yes yes please repeat first draw the whole rectangle and then we have to draw the four holes okay agya upar part ka dungi cha sir and inter circle sir okay then tell me how to draw this out out outside part outline part we can say how to draw this outline part radius 1.00 no okay just listen okay now which dimension they have given see here first of all start from this point okay now see here this dimension they have given okay this dimension they have given all right this dimension what is this dimension yes 4.25 25 okay again see here again from this point again from this point okay from this point again this dimension is also given this time so what is this dimension yes 6.88 yes 6.88 okay then tell me what is this di dimension What is this dimension? Yes. Four point twenty-five. Yes. Four point twenty-five. Again, 25. it is same, na? And again, tell me what is this dimension? Yes. What is this dimension? Six point eight eight. Six point eight eight. That is the six point eight. 
means first upon we have to draw this rectangle you can say this this outline part we have to draw okay now suppose we have draw this then already we have got this as the center point for the circle now we have to consider this is the center point for that of the circle okay from the center point again we can easily draw this circle merit whatever i kata apnala center point betle dani with the help of this center point we can easily draw this four circle yes and what is the radius of this circle yes please what is the radius of this circle diameter the less that the circle yes diameter they have given see okay phi they have given 1.062 and four hole this is the diameter of that four hole okay it is the meaning of that then once we have to draw this four hole then again it is similar process so how to draw this outline part how to draw this outline part and tell me yes please yes again similar process whatever process we have carried out in that last figure similar process we have to use here yes now tell me how to draw this outline part yes asavari pragati sir the radius select na that circle card na for non the same karna yes सर रेडियस दिले की नदी सर्कल काढायचा आणि नंतर ट्रिम करायचा हम्म राईट ला हा व्हिच रेडियस मी सी आर एंड देन स्टैंड इन लाइन मी जॉइन दे हैव गिवन दिस रेडियस हां दिस रेडियस रेडियस दिस रेडियस वी कैन सी द रेडियस ऑफ दिस कर्व अगेन द रेडियस ऑफ दिस कर्व अगेन द रेडियस ऑफ दिस कर्व अगेन द रेडियस ऑफ दिस कर्व दे हैव गिवन ओके बाय कंसीडरिंग दिस एज अ सेंटर पॉइंट वी हैव टू ड्रॉ द सर्कल डायरेक्टली नो प्रॉब्लम ऑफ द रेडियस 1 Again in this side also we have to draw the circle. Again in this side also we have to draw the circle by considering this as the center point. Okay, from the center point again we have to draw the one circle of the radius one. Radius one, radius one. Okay, and then what is this line? This is the tangent line. Na? Draw the tangent, tangent line. line. Draw the tangent line. Again we have to draw the tangent line. In this way we will draw this figure. Similar process, na? सर आपण हाफ फिगर काढून मिरर पण करू शकतो ना यस नो प्रॉब्लेम यू कॅन काढून मिरर करू शकतो यस इट्स नो प्रॉब्लेम यू कॅन डू ओके हम समजले का हा सर सो वी विल ट्राई टू ड्रॉ दिस ओके सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल ड्रॉ वन हॉरिजॉन्टल लाइन ऑफ अ डिस्टेंस अ यस 4.25 and then vertical line of a 6.88 okay just remember this dimension and tell me 4.25 and 6.88 okay go to the line make a click select the line command draw one horizontal line of a distance of 4. Yes. Two five. Two five. Okay. Enter. S. Then again select the line command and draw the vertical line of distance. Yes. Six point eight eight. Six point eight eight. Six point eight eight. Eight eight, na? Okay. Ha, sir. Six point eight eight. Enter S. Okay. Hmm. Then now, with the help of this dimension, we have to draw this rectangle. Again, in this side, four point twenty five enter, and we have to join it. Okay, it is clear. Yes, please. And now, we have to consider. the center point for that four circle okay see this is the first center point here first center point then this is the second this is third and this is the fourth 
two, three, and four. Okay. At that four center point, we have to draw the circle. And what is the radius or diameter of that circle? Yes. One point zero six two. One point zero six two. See here. Here they have given the diameter of that four circle. One point zero six two. Okay. Then make a click circle. Then diameter na diameter. Okay, draw the first circle at this point. Yes, please. Zero point a. One point zero six two. One point. One point zero six two. Zero six two. Okay. Enter escape. Okay. Again, see here. Again, the similar circle is required at this point, this point, and this point. So, can I copy it? Yes, we will copy this circle. Enter, select this center point. Then select this center point. Again, this center point, and again this center point. Okay, that four circles are complete. Okay, understood? How the circles I have drawn? Yes, please. Yes, sir. Okay. Then see the given figure. Then what is the which part is remaining? Okay. Then we have to draw. We have to draw this circle by considering the center point. From the center point, we have to draw this circle. Okay. This circle we have to draw at four corner. And what is the radius of this circle? Radius of the circle is equal to one. Okay, yes, please. Yes. Yes, sir. Okay, the radius is equal to one. Radius is equal to one, and radius is equal to one. Okay, and then we have to use the tangent line. Okay, go here. Okay, then take the radius circle. And select this point. From this point, we have to draw the circle of radius one m. Enter S. Okay. Again, similar circles are required at this corner also. Okay. That at that three point. So that we have to use which command? We have. I should use. Yes. Yes. Copy. How to copy. Copy. Just you can use the copy or you can just select the another circle and one by one you can draw the. Circle at that three point also, but we have to minimize our work so that directly I will make a click on the copy, select this circle, enter, select this center point, and just we have to make a click on the center point. Here we want to do the copy. Okay, escape. Okay, it is clear. Yes. Yes. Then, yes, then just we have to join these two circle with the help of the tangent line. Then how to draw the tangent line? We are knowing that the procedure. Make a click on the line, press the shift, right click, then select the tangent, tangent. and select the quarter point. Okay. Then line, shift, right click, tangent. Again, we have to select this. Then line shift right click tangent and select the quarter point where we want to make the tangent line. Line shift right click tangent select this. Okay, and then we have to trim the unwanted portion. Just we have to type tr double enter and select the unwanted portion. Okay, so it is correct. Yes, please. Yes. Yes, sir. Okay. 
and then finally we have to go the dimension so that all the parts Yes. Center line. Okay, we will also discuss about that. No problem. Hmm? Okay. Draw the sorry. This distance we have to show here. Again, this distance also we have to show here. Okay. It is visible to all this dimension. Yes. Yes, dimensions are visible to all. Yes, please. Dimensions are visible to you or not? No, sir. Okay, then how to increase the size of this dimension number? Okay, press the D, enter modify then texture and increase the text height again it is now it is visible yes please reply me yes, yes sir, sir it is visible okay. then show this radius also it is one but again, it is showing very large. So again, we have to minimize the size of this number. Just press the T, enter, modify, text and height. Again, it is big. No problem. Okay. So understood how to draw? Yes, yes please. Sir. Okay, so again, we will take next example. Okay, so we'll take this example. Okay, so we'll tell me, we'll tell me how to draw this figure. How to draw this 2D figure in that AutoCAD. Yes, please. Yes, anyone, please. How to draw? Again, it is very simple. No? Yes, please. How to draw this figure? Circle command use for narration, ten ten radius command. Okay, for which part we have to record the ten ten radius? Sir, the curve part, Nika. Okay, for this curve part, uh, we have to use the ten ten radius circle. Okay, very good. Then. Please half tell figure card in mirror corner. Yes, yes, please repeat. Half figure card in mirror corner, sir. Okay. Then just tell me the stepwise procedure. Okay, stepwise procedure. How to draw first upon from where we have to start the figure. Okay, which circle we have to draw? What is the dimension? Then like this we have to tell. Yes. Akanksha. Yes, sir. Shalke, Akanksha, Shalke. Yes, sir. Oh, huh, please tell me how to draw this figure. Hmm. Okay. Now see here. One eighty five the vertical line draw for us. One. One eighty five. Five one eighty five. Ninety plus eighty. Me sangu ka. Ah yes. Sir, this center line ka Okay. For a center pas na fifty ani seventy chhe ek line marunge chhi. Ani par a height. Jodia uh, Hetodi total height upon Major Karungeti, Parat Adikalsa circle Kadungeta 
आणि नाही आधी वरचा सर्कल काढून घ्यायचं परत त्याच्या मिडल पासन खाली नाईन्टी एट ला सेकंड सर्कल जो आहे सेव्हन्टी डिस्टन्स वर तो काढून घ्यायचा आणि त्यानंतर त्याच्या मिडल पासन खाली एटी सेव्हन ला दुसरा जो आपण इकडनं फिफ्टी घेतलंय तर तो खालचा सर्कल काढून घ्यायचा then anyone want to say something okay so i will tell you how to draw this simple in simple way okay there are other different ways are there me sangtoy he patun kadna asa pan kay nahi you can use your logic also no problem hmm? there will be the different ways to draw this figure okay so see here first of all we have to draw one horizontal line like this okay i will start from bottom side huh? first of all we have to draw one horizontal line of the 100 mm okay once we have to draw one horizontal line at the 100 mm then we can we will got we can get we can say the center point of this circle the end end point the end point of this line will be the center point for this circle and from this center point we can easily draw this circle again we can easily draw this circle and in similar manner okay we can make the copy same circle at this side also okay in this part will be completed then okay then i will take the center point or mid point of this line and then i will draw okay i will draw one vertical line upper distance is 87 okay upper distance is 87 like this see 87 la a vertical line i will draw okay then see here from this 87 oh, or from this point i will draw one vertical sorry horizontal line here okay i will draw one horizontal line here at a distance of 70 because they have given the 70 okay so that we will got the end point of this line will be the center point for the circle okay and then okay then we can easily draw this circle okay we can easily draw this circle then then again from this point okay again from this point i will draw one vertical line like this okay i will draw one vertical line of a distance huh? yes what is what will be the distance of this line 98 98 simple they have given i have see 98 and the end point of this vertical line from this end point we will get the center point for this circle then we can easily draw this circle okay okay means up till now we have draw this circle again this circle again this circle again again similar process see from this point huh? from this point okay from this point from this point again we have to draw one vert oh, sorry horizontal line at a distance of uh, 70 mm here okay 70 mm and again we will got the center point for this circle and we can easily draw this circle okay okay means that all circle we have drawn and then how to draw this curvature part uh, this curve okay for this curve we have to use the tan tan radius circle okay here also we have to use the tan tan radius circle again to draw see here to draw this curve similar process tan tan radius circle tan tan radius okay and here also we have to use the tan tan radius and here also we have to use the tan tan radius then tell me what is the radius of this curve yes what is the radius of this curve it will be the 80 for that all the okay in this way we can easily draw okay in simple in the simple way okay so understood yes please okay so we will start yes sir okay we will start okay i will draw delete it make the click on the 
line command okay i will start from the bottom side first of all draw the horizontal line of a distance 100 because they have given the 100 okay so zoom in okay again see here the text and y coordinate it will be come inside this figure or in in the middle of this uh, screen then how to fix that you say at the corner please tell me anyway. how to fix this x and y coordinate at the one of the corner yes please yes anyone please reply me how to fix this x and y coordinate at this corner now it is in in the screen in, at the middle of the screen we can see yes please how to fix that x and y coordinate at the one of the corner U C S. Okay, just have to press the U C S. Then, then U C S icon and no origin. U C S icon and no origin. Now see, now it is fixed at the corner. Okay, then <coughs> then see here. Okay, I have drawn here the horizontal line of the hundred mm. Then at this the end point of this line, we have to draw the circles two circles and they have given the diameter or we can see the radius of the circle then what is the radius of this two circle r50 and r25 am i right 25 okay see here r50 sorry r15 and r25 and in this side also same size of circle is required just you have to remember the radius of that circle r50 and r25 okay so make, make a click on that circle select the radius select this as the center point draw the sorry draw first circle r15 enter then second what is the dimension of that second circle 25 yes. r25 25. Enter. okay again similar size of circles we have required at this side also then we have to use the copy command okay select this circle select this circle then enter select this, this center point and again we have to select this center okay understood that bottom side part is complete then what is the next step yes what is the next step then vertical have, line okay good vertical line then we have to take the midpoint of this horizontal line already we have drawn this horizontal line Okay, then we have to take this midpoint and from this midpoint we have to draw a vertical line of a distance 85, sorry 87 and from this point we have to draw one horizontal line of a 70 so that we will call the center point of this circle. Yes, may I write? Yes, please. Yes, yes. Sir. Okay, then draw it. Okay, take the line then check the midpoint of this see this is the midpoint from this sorry sorry just point select the line check the midpoint so this is the midpoint and from this point draw the vertical line of 87 na? 87 may I write? yes sir okay and then then so here from this point okay from this point again we have to take the line and from this point we have to draw one horizontal line of a distance of horizontal line. seven zero seven seventy mm. okay, okay now see here the end point of this line will be the center point for the, we got the, circle. Point of the circle okay good and then tell me what is the radius of that circle see here just check huh? what is the radius of this circle tell me yes please. okay see here these two circles are similar circles see this circle and this circles are similar circle and here the dimension they have given r30 r30 and r20 20. 20. R30 and R20, then make a click on this circle, select the radius circle, okay, select this as a center point, 
and yes tell me the radius of that circle r yes 20 okay okay again see the given figure okay in this side also see in this side also okay in this side also we have to draw the similar circle here from this line we have drawn here one vertical line of 87 again we have draw here one horizontal line at a 70 in this side also from this point up from this point again we have to draw one again we have to draw one yes horizontal line of a distance uh, 70 here and we will get we will got this center point and from this center point again we have to draw this two circles clear it yes yes sir then just follow the similar process make the line sorry draw take the line command from this point draw the horizontal line of a 70 and by considering this end point as a center point from this we have to draw the two circles or we can directly copy these two circles okay because the dimensions are same make the copy enter select the center point and take this center point okay so understood yes please yes sir okay then the next point is check the given now we are at up to this point now we are at this point okay now again from this point from this point again we have to draw one vertical line of a distance of 98 see this distance they have given 98 and the end point of this point, uh, line we have to consider the center point for this circle and from this center point we have to draw these two circles yes may right and the radius of that circles they have given what is the radius r20 r30 okay just follow the procedure yes please take the line from this line again we have to draw yes vertical line of 98 na just one half the 90 Take the line from this point. Ninety-eight. Uh, okay, enter escape. Then, okay, we have to draw the circles. Take the circle, or okay, again I will make the copy. Copy of the circles. Enter escape because the dimensions are same. No, something is wrong. I will directly draw. Radius. What is the radius of the circle? R twenty and R thirty. Merit. R thirty. R thirty. Okay. Means here that all circle we have drawn. And which part is remaining? Yes. Which part is remaining? Just we have to draw the. Yes. Curve part. Curve part. Okay. Means here one, two, three, four, five curves are required. Okay, then how to draw the curve? Please listen carefully. It is very important part. Okay, make a click on that circle. Select the tan tan radius circle. Means tangent tangent circle. Make a click and select quarter point. See, I have select this point again. This point and give the radius. What is the radius? Is the yes. What is the radius? Eighty. Eighty. Zero. Interest. See. Again, similar process. Again, select the tan tan radius circle. Again, select this quarter point. Again, this quarter point. Select the eighty. Interest. Again, similar process. 
10 10 10 radius so like this has a cotton point again cotton point enter it okay. then again similar process 10 10 10 radius again select this as the cotton point this as the cotton point to the radius 80 okay and then at the bottom side also we have to require the curve so that again make the click on the tan tan radius circle select this as this tangent point this as the tangent point okay then 80 interest So again, I put it and turn the circle. So this is the tangent point and this is the tangent point. Okay. So yeah, then what will be the next step? Yes. Yes, trim please. The unwanted part. Okay, then I have to trim the unwanted part. Just press in the TR, double enter. See here, this is not required. Again, it is not required. Again, it is not required. Again, it is not required. Now check. Yes, please. It is correct. Yes. Yes, sir. Then delete the helping lines. Yes. It is clear. Yes, please. Yes, anyone please reply me. Underscore yes, sir. Or... Okay. It is very yes, simple. Then again, we have to go the dimensions. Okay, so I will go to dimension here. Again, the dimensions are not visible. Then how to increase the size of that dimension number? Yes, press the D, enter, modify. Then text fit and I will directly draw here one point and the rest. Again, it is not so T enter modify. Okay, now it is visible under it's here. Okay. Then take the linear dimension from this point to this point. It is it is seven. Okay. Then again take the linear and again from this point to this point it will be the seventy. Okay, then radius, okay, or 30, then again radius to this point also is 18, again radius to this is a 25, again radius to this inside circle is the okay so understood yes sir so nine back in yes yes please nine get distance 98 distance 98 back yes Just okay. Yes, now it is clear. Yes, sir. So 
this is about this figure and in this way we have to draw this figure in that autocad okay so understood which commands i have used in this way i have in which way i have drawn this figure yes please so anybody having any doubt any problem regarding to this no sir okay. so we'll take again next example Okay, it is visible to all. Just one minute. Okay, it is visible to all. This figure. Yes, sir. Hmm. Ha, sir. Okay, just one minute. can we try to draw this figure yes ha sir ha sir okay. so we will take this figure okay again somewhat complicated is there but it is very simple okay then you tell me first of all how to draw yes please try to understand the given figure yes please anyone please ha huh? yes anyone having any idea just see the figure and try to understand the geometry of that figure which parameters are there which dimension they have given which commands we have to require yes just see in simple way okay. see here Okay, so see here the diameter. What is the diameter of this circle? This big circle. Yes. Okay, just tell me what is the diameter of this big circle. Please reply me first. Only two students are giving the reply. What about others? Yes. Ah, huh. what is the diameter of this circle? They have given one diameter. See here. it is the 50 58 or 51 58 yeah. 58 58 okay 58 okay already they have given the 58 okay then see here then again they have given the diameter of this dotted circle see here this circle 40 what is the diameter of this dotted circle or we can say the circle yes 50 yes 40 put diameter this is the 40 okay then how to draw this circles which commands are required to draw this already i have explained yes what is this circles yes which type of the array is there whether it is array na yes circular yes polar array polar array is required okay and what is the diameter of that small circle is there Ten. Yes, ten is ten. They have given. How many holes are required on the periphery of the circle? Eight. Eight. Okay. Means this this part, ah, huh? this part we can easily draw. No problem. There is no problem. Then check next point. Then okay. Again check from this point, from this center point. what will be this distance what will be this distance please tell me up to this point yes 68 how it is 68 60 okay. yes yes please please ha huh? yes 
it is 68 now no problem because they have given us here it is the 34 and 34 just 34 plus 34 it will be the 68 merit so this distance this distance it will be the 38 it is clear Rauf? yes sir then means from this center point from this center point now again we can easily draw the circle what is the diameter of the circle? Yes. 58. It is the 58. Good. It is the 58. Then, again from the center point, we can easily draw the circle. What is the diameter of the circle? 36. 36. 36. 36. 36. No. Again, here we have to require the polar arrays. How many circles are required? Six circles Six. with diameter. Six circles. Eight, eight diameters. Eight. Okay. okay, means here we can easily draw this part also. See, we can say this is the first part, this is the second part. Okay, the two parts we can easily draw. There is no any difficulty. Okay, then next. Yes. Then please. Huh. Then next, how to draw? Yes. Sir, the uh, 34 and ah. 34 chi middle line card on Gachi. Any mug the J 20 radius a circle and he cut the 15 and I have 15 sa diameter sa uh, circle card on Gacha. Any per the cha out outside chip and card on Gachi circle. I'm not understood. Hmm? See here, they have given this distance. Huh? See here, what, what will be this distance? 40. 40 they have given. 40. See here, huh? again from this side, no. again it will be the 40. Okay. Kedar, please. Kedar, Abankar Kedar. Yes, sir. Again, it will be the 40. Okay, means in this side 40, in this side 40. Okay, we will got this center point. Again, this center point. Okay, we can easily draw this circle. What is the diameter of the circle? Yes. 50. 15. They have given here. Again, we can easily draw this circle. What is the diameter of the circle? It is the? 22. 22. Then, Again, we have to follow the similar process here in this side. From this center point, this radius they have given. What is the, this radius? 20. 20. Means here we have to draw one circle of the radius 20. 20. And then we have to join this line with the help of the tangent. Tangent. So this is the tangent. Okay. Just you have to understood the difference between that tan, tan radius and tangent. Huh? Okay. radius the less. radius is line. It is line. It is line nah? It is not a radius. So that I am using the tangent line. Okay. Means this part is also completed. Then only this side is remaining. Okay. This side is remaining. Then yes, please. Then how to draw? Okay. Again, see here from this point. Again from this point. This radius they have given. What is this radius? Yes. 20. 20. Means again we have to draw this circle. Okay. And here we have to draw this curve. But it is not a tangent. It is curve because they have given the radius. Okay. And then we have to draw this curve. We have to use the tan tan radius circle. Because this tangent, sorry, this curve is tangent to the circle and this circle and radius is given. In similar manner, again we have to draw same uh, tangent or curve here also. Okay, in this way we have to try to draw this figure to draw in that. Act. So understood how to draw? Yes, please. Yes, sir. Yes, yes sir. sir. So we we'll just try to draw this figure in that. Act. Okay. So first of all, we have to draw this circle. This part we have to complete first of all, the topmost part. 
okay just you have to remember the dimension 58 and 40 okay 40 okay. so i will delete it okay then go to the circle and select the diameter circle na because they have given the diameter what is the diameter of that big circle 58 na right? 58 ha sir okay 58 okay so this is the 58 then again we have to draw one more circle here now what is the diameter of that circle yes 40 40 na ha sir 40 enter is there check the given figure here okay 40 58 and then we have to draw that small circle with the help of the polar array now what is the diameter of that small circle 10 and how much quantity is required 8 okay just check how to draw it 8 okay go to the circle select the diameter of circle diameter of circle is given of that small circle small circle ka apnalo kay dile diameter dile ka ready dile yes diameter just draw diameter okay dae the 10 diameter then select the diameter circle here we have to draw a circle of 10 mm enter s okay then we have to click on this array see array here we have to select the polar array then select this circle enter okay then select the center point sorry sorry, sorry. One second, I will repeat. Polar array. Select this center. Enter. Okay. And how many items are required here? Eight, na? Yes. Eight. Here, here in that items here here at the topmost side, items are given here. You have to type whatever items you have to require. Okay. Enter. Yes. So understood how to draw this? Yes. Understood how I have to draw this? Yes, please. Yes or no? Yes, sir. Okay. Then check the given figure. Okay. Means here this part is completed. This part is complete. This part number one. Part number one is complete. Then again from the center point. Again from the center point, we have to draw one vertical line. Of a distance of sixty-eight, and here we have to by considering this as the center point. Again, we have to draw here the two circles, one and two. Okay, now right. So first of all, I will draw one vertical line of a sixty-eight from the center point of this circle. Take the line, select this, and draw the sixty-eight vertical line. Okay. Yes. Yes, may I write? Yes, please. Yes, sir. Ah. Huh. Then. Sir. Ah. Huh. Ek da pula re re se sanga. Okay, here, here I will explain here. Ah. Huh? In this side also we have to require the pula re. Okay, here I will explain once again. So see here. Uh, this vertical line we have drawn here, and this is the center point. Okay, and from the center point we can easily draw this circle. Just have to remember the diameter of this circle. What is the diameter of these two circles? Yes. Now we are at this point. Huh? Okay. Now we are at this point. And from this point we have to draw this circle of the 58, and this circle it will be the 60. Sorry, 36. And then we will draw that polar. Line. Remember this two lines, right? Nah? And tell me. Hmm. Take the diameter of radius. Yes. Diameter. Diameter. And what is the diameter of that first circle? Yes. Fifty-eight. Fifty-eight. And then second. Thirty-six. 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 Then. Again, in similar manner, we have to draw the polar array. See the given figure. This is called as the polar array. This is the polar array. 
this is the polar array this circle okay when we are draw this circle on the periphery of that circle it is called as the polar array okay so now see here first of all we have to draw one circle one circle we have to draw okay how many circles we have to record here six circle six holes are required of a diameter eight okay so just listen carefully how i'm going to draw this array command i'm going to use that array command okay first of all sorry see here. first of all we have to take the diameter circle and here here we have to draw the one circle of a dia eight and now we have to make click here so this is the polar array make the click on polar array select this polar array select this small circle small circle select kare sir make a click on that then press the enter then then select the center point of this circle okay so automatically it will take the array and here at this top corner okay so i will show you okay see here at this just one minute okay at this top corner see the atoms are given, atoms okay it is visible and here we have to type the whatever atoms we have to record how many atoms are required here yes six six so no problem so enter s so understood yes yes sir okay board okay yes yes sir okay, okay. so check the given figure okay means here we have drawn these two parts which part so here this part this part is completed this part is completed then what is the next step again from yes okay from this point to this point it is the 34 okay from that 30 point uh, 34 we have to make click here and from this side we have to draw horizontal line of the 40 and in this side also we have to draw the horizontal line of the 40 okay and then we have to draw this circle okay first of all we will try to cover this this side first of all we will try to cover this side okay okay take the line on this side to the 34 okay and and here it is the 40 enter and in this side also it is the 40 enter s the line it is the 40 okay then we have to draw this circle what is the diameter of this circle yes 15 then okay 15 take the diameter circle here make a click and draw the 15 mm circle enter s okay so what is the next step this circle we have to again again from this point again from this point we have to draw this circle what is the radius of this circle 20 in this way we have to draw this circle and then we have to join this three circle with the help of this tangent line okay yes may i write yes please yes sir okay then just remember the dimension r20 r they they are going to r20 make it click on the circle select the radius circle here make it click and draw the circle of the r20 enter s okay yes yes sir yes sir okay then we have to join this circle and this circle with the help of the tangent line na right? yes select the line shift right yes. click this shift right click tangent here Just one minute. It is not clearly joined. I will repeat. 
line shift right click tangent line shift right click tangent and here also we have to draw the tangent line then it is not joined properly so that i will repeat take the line shift right click tangent okay. so this side is complete okay then next side in this side in this side is remaining again already we have drawn this horizontal line at a 40 here we have to consider the center point and then we have to draw this circle of the radius yes 22 okay and again from this point we have to draw this circle of a r20 just have to remember diameter is the 22 and radius is the 20 Take the diameter then ah, 20 diameter and then we have to draw the one big circle of what is the radius of the circle 20 radius 22 diameter so one second i will check whether it is correct what is the diameter of the small circle it is the 22 na? 22 Okay, 22 enter and then we have to draw this radius is the 20 now. Interesting. Okay. Then again, it is very important part is this. Now see. How much was the part? How to draw this? Okay, how to draw this curve with the help of the 10, 10 radius. Okay. See the quadrant point. Quadrant point magic I bag. He is like a hill and I can hell and check a little touch of IG and he has a little touch on the circle. He could touch current. It is called as the quadrant. You have quadrant modesta and I have quadrant modesta. Okay. So R. So we will try to draw this with the help of the 10 10 meter circle. Go to the circle, select the 10 10 meter circle, select this and select this and R15 enter. Okay, it is correct. And in this side also, in this side also, we have to draw the 10 10 meters. In this side, check. Huh? Check the quadrant. Huh? See, in this side also. How to draw? Above this line, we have to click. Above this line, again, in inside of, sorry, in this side of this line. Here line change side left touch correct and here line change the side left touch correct. Okay. R15. Then take the 10 10 radius circle okay. here, yes, and here R15 enter. Okay, yes, and then we have to trim the unwanted portion by pressing the TR double enter. Okay. This circle is not required, na? This part is required or not required? Not required. It is not required. Then no problem. Okay. So I will delete that helping lines. Okay, so understood. Yes, anybody having any doubt, any problem, please tell me. Yes, please, Avantika. Yes, please, anyone, please reply me. No, sir. Understood? Yes, sir. Okay, 
then escape and do the dimension. Diameter of the circle is 58. So the size of that figure is more. So I will minimize the inter modify text then select radius do the radius to this part again sorry radius into this part okay then select the linear distance from this point this point this is the 68 okay and again the linear distance this point to this point it will be the 80 okay then the radius of this curve also we have to show you 20 and diameter of this circle it will be the 15 again diameter of this circle is the 22 okay again the diameter of this circle is the minimum okay so understood yes please yes sir yes sir okay so in this way yes sir. you have to draw this figure with the help of that okay so we'll take next example again complicated example i will take here Yes. Can I draw this? Yes, tell me how to draw this. Or can we take this figure? Hook, train hook. Yes. Yes, sir. Then tell me you. Okay, from your side, please tell me now how to draw. Up till now, I have taken number of figures. Just you have to tell me how to draw this. Yes, please. Sir, Adi center line card is and you okay. say don't circle card is Adi Okay. Hmm, then. Hmm, then. That's a difference given, sir. Khalipan circle card. Okay, then. Please tell me step by step. Just observe the figure, analyze the figure, check whether that all dimensions are given, and then with the help of that dimension, also we have to analyze which commands are required, and then you have to tell me stepwise which part first upon we have to draw. What is their dimension? Then next, then next, like this, you can tell. Yes, who will tell me? Yes, Avantika. Yes, please. Hmm. Raut, Kulis Patil, Pawar. Dakshata Hello, me audible? Yes, sir. It is difficult or simple? 
it is very simple simple is then tell me a procedure step wise procedure how to draw this screen hook in that art okay सर जे रेडियस दिले आहेत ते रेडियस ने सर्कल काढायचे आणि मग ट्रिम करायचे यू आर डायरेक्टली लुकिंग ऑन द ट्रिम सी ओके वी विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम दिस साइड फ्रॉम टॉप साइड आई विल स्टार्ट ओके सो सी हियर इन फर्स्ट अप ऑन वी हैव टू ड्रॉ दिस सर्कल ओके मी राइट बिकॉज दे हैव गिवन द डाय ऑफ द सर्कल व्हाट इज द डायमीटर ऑफ द सर्कल it is the 25 again we can easily draw this circle what is the die of this circle it is the 50 right yes, yes. Sir. Okay. then then again from this point huh? from this point suppose i have drawn one vertical line of a distance 120 may right see because they have okay. given the 120 right so this is the 120 okay this is the 120 okay this is the 120 and suppose we will get this as the center point and from this center point we have to draw we have to draw this circle okay this, what is the radius is the 25 okay yes, sir this we have to draw again see here again one more they have given point they have given from this point see carefully yeah? okay from this point again from this point to this they have given the some distance what is this distance 9 9 okay means we have to draw on a horizontal line and we have to mark this point and from this point from this point from this point again we have to draw this big circle this big circle like this what is the radius of this circle if it is not showing you have to consider it is the 56 huh? okay it is the 56 hmm? okay so that much part is understood yes doctor yes, okay then then okay suppose once i have drawn this two circles so this one circle and this two circle if we have drawn then we can easily join this with the help of the tan tan radius circle see the each and every figure we have to record the tan tan radius circle when your curve is there directly if curve is there okay one and radius you have given directly you can use the tan tan radius circle no problem okay see here and then this distance they have given what is this distance what is this distance yes 28 okay 20 is means inside 40 inside 40 and we have to draw randomly one vertical line huh? randomly no problem randomly you can draw and already we have drawn this circle and here we have to join with the help of the tangent circle like this okay understood yes yes sir okay yeah. then then again then see here from this point from this point uh, this point they have given the distance yes tell me what is this distance this vertical uh, horizontal distance is 50 50 50, 50. 50. and see here from this point suppose i have drawn one vertical uh, sorry horizontal line of the 50 and the end point of this line it will be here and from this point again we have to draw one vertical line see here here uh, they have given this vertical distance what is this vertical distance 28 28 okay here okay again now we are at this point and from this point again we have to draw the circle see this circle this circle again we have to draw what is the radius of this circle 6.5 6.5 okay then once you have to draw this circle already this circle we have drawn huh? this this big circle we have drawn again we have to join this circle with this circle with the help of this tan tan circle so tan tan radius this curve and this curve okay what is the radius of this curve 30. yes 38 and what is the radius of this curve it is 56 56 okay. in this way we have to draw this way. simple way. okay so we will try to draw
okay just remember this dimension of that circle what is the diameter of that circle that is the 25 and 50 first of all we will draw these two circle huh? okay tell me yes diameter na yes sir ah, tell me the diameter of ah, both, both the circle 50 and 25 25 and 50 five zero na Ah, yes, yes. Ah, yes. Okay, then again we have to take the line from this point. Again, we have to draw the vertical line of what distance? Sir? 120. 120. Okay, then 120. Then again from this center point, again we have to draw horizontal line of 9 mm. Enter the step and we will get this point. Okay. So and first upon from this point, up, 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 sorry, first upon by considering this center point, we have to draw the circle. Yes, this circle first upon we have to draw. This circle. Okay, this circle first upon draw. What is the radius? 20, 25. 25 and then from this point uh, we have to draw 50. this circle of the 56 remember this <laughs> just remember the dimension and tell you radius yes what is the radius 25. 20 25 enter escape and then 56, 56. 56. from this point now huh? it is the 56 enter escape Okay, so understood? Yes. Then again, we have to draw two vertical lines from this point. Don't apply vertical lines to draw. Okay, then what is the diameter or what is the distance between that two lines? 28. 28. Diameter okay, means... 28 and distance 14. 14. Good. Okay, means in this side it is the 40, in this side it is the 40. Yes, it is the 40. Yes, it is the 40. Okay, then again we have to use the offset command. See, offset. Okay, we click on this offset and give the distance of 40. Enter. Select this line at this side and select this line at this side. Okay. Then trim the non portion TR double enter. See, this part is not required here. Okay. Okay. Just one minute. Okay, so understood. Then next is we have to draw this curve. Okay, this curve we have to draw. This curve. Okay, this curve. How to draw this curve? Already we have drawn this circle. This line is also we have drawn like this. Okay. With the help of the tan tan radius. What is the radius they have given? Radius of the curvature is 50. R50. And here 56. Huh? Both the radius are different. There is no common radius. For this circle, this curve, it is the 56, and for this, it is the 50. Okay. So, first of all, we will try to draw this curve here. Okay. Take the 10 10 radius circle. Okay. Then select this line. Select this. And what is the radius? 50. 50. 50. So trim the unwanted portion TR, sorry, TR, double enter. Okay. Okay, so understood? Yes. Then, again, see here. Again, we can draw this curvature. Right, this curve again. We have to draw 
this curve and this curve is touched to this small circle the small circle is touched hota hai lakshat asu de what is the radius of this curve 56. 56 again here we have to use the which command tangent radius circle command go to the here select the tangent radius circle select this quadrant select this quadrant point and give the 56 and press okay yes it is right yes sir then press the tr double enter and trim the knot Okay, understood. Yes. yes. Okay. Again, it is very simple part of the unit. Then what will be the next procedure or next step? Yes, please. See the D one figure. Then tell me. Again, see here from this point. Okay. See this distance they have given. It is the fifty. Means from this point, uh, we have to draw one horizontal line of a fifteen mm. Again, from this end point, again we have to draw a vertical line of a distance twenty eight. And from this point, we have to draw this circle of six point five. Okay, understood? Yes. Yes, please. Yes, sir. Okay, take the line. Take a line from this point. Line command. Okay, from the center point, draw the horizontal line of the fifty. Enter, and then vertical twenty-eight. Twenty-eight. Vertical. Which is the twenty-eight? Oh, sorry, twenty-eight. Enter. Okay. Now, see here. And okay, at from this point, we have to draw the circle. We circle. So this circle. We have this circle. This circle, see this circle, and the radius of this circle is six point five. Six point five. Okay, so draw this. Take the radius circle from this point. Six point five, na? Yes. Half. Interest. Okay. Then, see so the given figure. Which part is remaining? Okay, now this circle is completed. Again, this circle is we are having. Okay, just see carefully here. Okay, now we have to join this circle, this circle with this bigger circle. This bigger circle already we have drawn here. This bigger circle. Okay, then how to join with the help of this ten ten radius circle? Ten ten radius circle. What is the radius of this curve? Thirty-eight. Yes. yes, it is the thirty-eight. First of all, we will try to draw this curve and then insert thirty-eight. Okay. Yes. Okay. I will first of all delete this uh, helping line. Okay. Then take the ten ten radius circle. Select this bottom point. Select this. What is the radius? Thirty-eight. Thirty-eight, na? Na. Enter. Okay. Then I will trim the unwanted portion. Tr double enter. So it is not required. Then it is not. Then again we have to draw. See this curve. This curve we have. Which curve? This curve. And this curve it touches to this inside circle. This inside circle. Okay. Now what is the radius? Fifty-six. See, this is the fifty-six. Okay. Then take the ten ten radius. Like this. Like this sign. Yes, radius. Fifty-six. 
to 6 and enter escape. Okay, then I will trim the non trim portion TR, double enter. Okay, so it is not required. See, this is the your train hook. It is correct? Yes. Yes, please. Yes, sir. It is correct or wrong? Correct. Yes, sir. It is correct. Then which, what is remaining here? Yes, please. See, see here. See this, this part is remaining. Here, here. They have given the radius. Yes. What is the radius? R3. And this side also R3. Again, we have to use the tangent in the circle. Take the tangent in the circle. Okay. So with this point, with this circle, and to the radius 3 mm and the rest. Okay. See. Then trim it. TR double enter. Okay. Now see. It is correct. Okay. And in this side also, we have to require the curvature or uh, curve of radius 3 mm. Then again, I will use the 10 degree circle. Okay. Select this, select this radius 3 mm, enter step. Then trim and enter portion TR double enter. I will zoom it so that it will look very easy. Okay. Now check. This is the your crane hook. Okay. So understood? Yes, please. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, then do the dimension. Diameter of the circle. It is 50. Okay. Enter. Hello, sir. Huh. We work a portion in power. Yes. Which portion? Huh. Which portion? Uh, the over the circle like and the like. Hello. Which? Ah, uh, two Hey, hey, hey. Ah. Uh, With the help of the. Two parallel caliber. Ha ha ha. Ah, two. With the help of the ten ten degree circle, na. Just we have to use the ten ten degree circle. See the given figure. Already we have drawn this circus this circle we have drawn what is the radius of this circle r56 okay and again we have draw here one vertical line okay just we have to join this vertical line with this curve with the help of the 10 10 radius circle okay we have to select the 10 10 radius circle we have to touch here we have to touch here and give the radius is the r50 automatically one circle is going to draw here like this we have to trim this portion and this curve we have to trim it. In this way, here also we have to follow this procedure for this curve. Again, we have to follow same procedure here also and here also. Okay, understood. Now, okay. And give the dimension. Okay, then give the dimension to that whole part. Okay, so this is about that. So understood. Yes. Anybody having any doubt, any problem? Okay. So that number of 2D figure we have taken and somewhat 2D figure also remaining. So we'll cover in that next lecture. Okay. Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. So see once again which figure we have covered. See this screen hook. Just one. Okay, see this screen hook we have covered. Merit? Yes. Then this figure, this is the water tap. Okay, in that next lecture, we will try to cover this water tap. This figure is completed. Again, this figure is also completed. This figure is completed. Okay, so number of 2D example we have taken, and the remaining 2D example I will cover in that next lecture also. Okay. So thank you.